Well, getting it starting to put it together. Um, I welded a bracket on there so it'd be a little higher so the tank actually sits level now. Also, I put a filter on it. When I made the frame, I forgot all about the filter. I was thinking the tank was going to run straight in to the pump. But, and there would be no room for the filter. So I had to move the tank over, which is fine. I got room for it there, and I just elbowed the uh, filter over. And it should hook right in with a piece of hose. Since it's a suction hose, uh, I don't need to be a whole lot, but this is a, this is a pretty good hose here. The guy sold me. Um, I don't know how many pounds it'll take, but I think it's, this is supposed to take 300. And I imagine that's on the suction side. So, but it's getting there. And I got room to put a bigger motor on there, which I. I'm, I'm almost positive I'm going to need at least to run the log splitter I don't know about running anything else well I got the majority of the power unit hydraulic power unit put together <clears throat> I still have to rebuild the hydraulic pump um, but the two uh, valves are on to operate it the tanks on. There's a couple of hoses yet I got to put on, but the, it's basically done. Um, once I rebuild the pump, I'll add some oil to it and give it a try. Well, I finally got this hydraulic power unit together. Oh, I tried it out. Well, first time I tried it out, uh, the pump I sucked up an O-ring. I put too small of an O-ring in it because I didn't know what size O-ring it was and I was afraid of putting too big a one in and it wouldn't uh, tighten up good. But that wasn't the problem. So I put a bigger one in and it seems to work good. The O-ring stayed in place. At least it's working. So I imagine the O-ring stayed in place. But anyhow, I have two valves on it. Uh, two quick couplers. Oh, this one I got to get two quick couplers for, but it'll run without. It'll run just one valve right now. Um, you know, whatever I need it to run. Except, like I said before, the motor. It's too small, which I knew it was going to be. And I don't know if a six and a half horse is even going to run it, which that's what I have. Uh, that's a three and a half. Um, not the log splitter, anyway. I don't think it will. Because it, it takes quite a bit of pressure to run that pump. But um, I'll probably have to look for something, maybe 13, 14 horsepower. Probably have to look for a used lawn tractor or something and uh, use that motor for it. But that should be no problem really uh, remounting it. But that's it.